First one, where does all energy come from? Okay. Number two, name four consumers. Remember consumers? Number three, what can producers do that consumers cannot do? And then finally, name two decomposers. There are some words on our word wall over here that might help you. Don't, don't be afraid to look at those. Humans. humans. Great question. We'll put humans up on our word wall. Let's just double check on our warm up. So the first question was, where does all energy come from? Where does all energy come from, Henry? Any energy comes from the sun. That's a great answer. Very nice. Energy comes from the sun. Was that a complete sentence, Diego? No. Do you want to say that one again, Henry? Energy comes from the sun. Is that a complete sentence? Yeah. yeah. Perfect. If you saw that sentence and you didn't have the question written down, you'd understand that sentence, right? What if you just put sun? We don't know what the question was. That doesn't make sense. Right? This is what the start screen will look like. Okay? You might have to log on. Has everybody logged on to these computers before yes. now? It says Control Alt Delete. I'll have one. I'm going to bring them to you in just a second. Control Alt Delete. Once you've logged on, it might require a password. Do you all remember this? Yeah. What's the most important part about this P? Capital, capital. capital P. You know. Here's how we're going to do it. I'm going to bring a computer to share with your table partner. I would like for you to take turns with the game. It gets more difficult as you go through the game, and it's a game of creating food chains and food webs. So, Diego, if you start, who gets the next game? Um, yeah. Isabella. After Isabella has played, who gets the next game? Right. It's a drag and drop. Are you familiar with drag and drop? Mm -hmm. You're going to click on the picture, drag it over to the box, and drop it. All right? Yeah, I'm so proud of you. Good Miss, job. Thank you. Miss Bowman? Yes. Our game isn't working. Okay. Uh, wait, never mind, never mind. Yeah. Oh, my God. No. Okay, next. Yeah. What am I, guys, if I do this? Remember, I'm standing at the sunshine. What producer. am I? Producer. A producer. What are these things? Yeah, leaves. Leaves. And what are they going to do for us? Yes, exactly. What am I doing if I do this? Eating. Eating. I must be a consumer. consumer. What am I if I do this? Decomposing. Oh, good job. Decomposing. What am I doing? Breaking it down. Breaking it down. You've got it. Well done. Yesterday we made food webs. Do you remember? Yeah. You came up to the board and we all drew lines to show our food webs. We're going to continue to learn about that today. And we're going to play a couple of games. What have we made here? A web. We've made a web like the one that we made on the board yesterday. Just for a second, what I'd like you to do, can you wrap it so that it's not all drapey? Yeah. Wrap it so it's all not, not all drapey. Now, just for a second, let's imagine that all the cone flowers, that's Alden, let's imagine that all the cone flowers were killed with a pesticide or a herbicide. So, Alden, what I'd like you to do is to tug on your line and tell me if you feel that. I feel that. Uh, a little bit harder. Can anybody feel that? Yeah. Yeah. No. You can't feel it? I can. Oh, no, I can. You can feel it? So if all the cone flowers go out, who does it affect? Quite a few of us. You, 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 yes. If, if your, all the cone flowers die, we would be in trouble.